What's good, YouTube? This is Sean Shoy. Back at it again with another NBA 2K21 My Team gameplay. And today, we're gonna open up some locker codes. This is the second op second episode of the No Money Spent series. And last episode, it was basically a tutorial of what you guys should do when you first open up My Team for the fir very first time. And now, this is the second day. So again, I'm on today's episode, how we get started by opening up the locker codes. There was a lot of locker codes that happened since I posted the first episode. And one of them is this pink diamond Bradley Beal. And man, dude, if we pulled this dude, you know how much time we saved on making a good team? First of all, we gotta get the pack. And second of all, we gotta get lucky on pulling him, but dude. If we pull this pink diamond, pink diamond Bradley Bill, we can either sell him or keep him. And dude, I'm telling you, the amount of time that you can you save, oh my lord, dude. All right, but on, let's see on the board. Shoot, the package pretty easy though. It's only in the bottom. All right, but. A tokens would be a plus two, so hopefully we can get the tokens. All right, we got two. I'm not sure how much tokens we got, guys, but wow, we didn't really get. The, I swear, if we land on blue, no, oh my, and it's a badge pack. But I'll take it because, dude, if we pull the Showtime badge, that's like easy 8k plus. Now, other codes are the flashback packs. And I think that was a new promo, right? There is flashback packs, which are glitch, and then there's the moments packs. So this is the locker code for the Flash, Hakeem, the Dream, a larger one. So you guys want to input this? Let's get right into the board. All right, let's see what the options are. So we get the same thing, but it's just a flashback pack instead of the pink diamond real pack. But it's a bigger board, but there's no tokens. This is gonna be a long freaking journey. I right, see. Do not land in the green. I saw if we get another badge pack. All right. All right. Oh my lord. Dude, man, if there's a token, the token wheel thing. Oh, don't go there. Don't go there. All right, we're good. Don't go to green. Dude, but this, his, this Akeem, too. This is like one of the best centers right now. And we land on the badge pack. That's crazy. But again, man, there are some badges that have pretty good value. And right now we're sitting at 1k. So somehow we can end up with 20k. That's how crazy some badges are worth, guys. So for the next code, we got another flash packs. So there are three other creator, creator YouTubers that play my team. And they gave us three flash flash locker codes today. So I'll put that in the screen for you guys to input. And yeah. So this is one of the first locker code guys. Pause the video real quick and take a moment to input that locker code. And now let's do the board. All right, come on. So same thing, but there's no token reward, whatever code you land. And another thing too, guys, is how should I drop the the ball? Like, is there a, so, woo, and we land on the pack? That's a big W. But for these boys, guys, how should I drop the ball? Like, should I start all the way at the end, or is there like another method that other my team players are using? But that's a dub right there. We got the Hakeem pack for a chance to get him. This is the second locker code, guys. So input that real quick. All right, so I'm assuming all these boards are gonna look all the same. But this one has the basketball pack, which we don't need. And I'm gonna drop it right here. That might be a little bit too late, but it's whatever. Usually I, I have a friend that told me to go on that side and usually goes to the middle. As you can see right there, it almost went to the middle, but we landed on the gold consumables pack, which is an L, but Again, anything with value will take it. 
And here is the final flash locker code. Now this was posted 49 minutes ago, so when I post this video guys, there might be more locker codes later on that 2K will post, but as of right now, this is the last locker code of the day. And let's see what we got. All right, come on. Let's do this, man. Let's get this Hakeem pack. Now, there was another, there was other, other cards too that the release was like Pink Diamond LeBron James, Pink Diamond Carmelo, Pink Diamond Kyrie. Now, I don't know what those stats are. I need to check them, but obviously we're not, our goal is not trying to get them because we're on a really low budget and we can't really afford them. So now, let's open these packs. Damn, we really only got one Hakeem. Alright, let's start with the badges first because sometimes you can pull some valuable badges. Please, please, Showtime. Nope, not Showtime. So if you guys get Showtime, man, like I said, 8K, 8K MT right there, guaranteed. Heart Crusher. And if we get 8K, that's like, there's like five players we can pull from the auction house. But damn, speaking of the auction house, since we only got this Akeem pack, we're probably only gonna get one player. And I believe that, oh no, we collected 30. Never mind, we unlocked the auction. I thought it was 30 players, but, and we got a Sapphire. But I thought, I thought it was like 30 player cards, but I forgot the other, there's some other cards too that count towards the collection. All right, but whatever, pull this, pull that. Oh, silver player. So we got two players out of this. Oh, that was a coach. Wow. All right, but we'll take the contracts. All right, so these gold consumables packs, really what you want out of these are the contracts because unless you pull a badge, but yeah, again, you just want the contracts because you're starting off the mode with really nothing. And we get a gold contract, got the dove right there. All right, so now, did we unlock the auction house? Oh no, cause we have to go to the agendas. And there you go, guys. We unlocked the auction house. All right, the first player for sure, for sure you wanna get is this Jarrett Jack Ruby? How much is he? How much is he? Fifteen hundred? Is he less? Dude, we're later. Oh no, we can sell the shoes. Let's sell the shoes real quick. Let's sell the shoes real quick. All right, for your shoes, you guys, you want to sell all of them. If they're all golden below. All right, so all the shoes we got are, are all golden below. So what you want to do is just sell them because really these are no use i mean there's there are some goals in the agendas where it gives you xp on leveling up for the seasons so you can earn the rewards but for the most part guys just sell your shoes all right so we sold all the shoes we got 3600 and now let's get this year jack now, before you just buy any Jerry Jack, make sure you're buying the one with the most contracts. So you want to get your empty, empties worth full. So we're just gonna buy the one with the five hundred for the five contracts. Let's do that real quick. Now here's why. Here's why you want this card. So well, let's add this to the collection. Here's why you want this card, guys. You look at the damn how you know I haven't touched this part but as you can see this is an evil card and if you look at his stats you're not getting any freaking player worth 1300 around that price range that has all these stats that can evo to get better even better stats and look at this guys 
you're not gonna have any low budget card with these stats all the stats you need basically are 80 and higher and if you look at his badges 45 and he has gold range i believe gold clamps too and he, he's 6'3 so he's not super undersized and this is one of the best point guards you can get on low budget and you just another thing too is that i i know i told you guys to just waste all your silver players and gold players but since this is an evil card and you earn contracts array by domination you get two packs worth of contracts so every time you win you can just put those contracts onto jerry jack every time he runs out of contracts so yeah that's what you want to do and now there's another point guard too that you guys can get which is tony roten but i might just wait on this dude a little bit just because by the time we finish domination 2k is probably gonna bring out more promos and bring out better low budget cards to get so let's see what his price range is on my main account i bought him for like 1600 so did he drop damn he's more expensive he's a ruby too bro 3k that's crazy all right guys so yeah never mind you just want to collect all your mt that you got from domination put that all into jerry jack and yeah that's pretty much it so now what you want to do is just actually no 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 let's do this so we got shack but he's not that great we can use him when we play like actual comp games which are domination or not domination unlimited and limited so but we're probably just gonna use it as a bench because as of right now there's really no good budget centers especially the ones that i could shoot but there is one guys one by the name of sean and the last name kept he's an amethyst now on my main account i bought him for 2k so hopefully he's there still all right is he cheaper 1800 no yeah he's 1200 all right 19 but did your contracts now i'm actually worth let's see can we get him for just 50 more mt all right well whatever i'm willing to buy him for a, just 100 more mt and the highest is three contracts actually i think amethyst go for that already so let's buy the one with the shoe just because it's free and there you go you got a center that can shoot there i don't on my main account i had i got lucky with getting bound shoes but here we go i don't know we gotta add it to the collection all right guys so this is pretty <laughs> we have three solidified players in our lineup that will for sure go into our limited and unlimited games now man i mean there's really nothing else we could do because until i finish domination guys this is what the this is all pretty much I can show you guys as of right now. Until I get Galaxy Opal Jameson. But by the time I get Galaxy Opal Jameson, guys, you know how much MT I'll have? You get like a thousand plus MT every game. And there are what? 33 games? So 33 times thousand is 33k oh my god i hope i did my math right and then there's also an agenda where if you finish all of the domination games right here 99 you get 20k added on with these other two 
So we're probably gonna be around 50k by the time I finish. And don't even forget about the tokens. But do not spend your tokens yet, because we're just gonna wait on 2k to update the token market and then we could use all of our like 150 plus tokens on the, those new players. But yeah guys, we unlocked the auction house and now we need to grind for Anton Jameson. So if you guys found this video helpful, go leave a like. And if you're new to the channel, subscribe. And make sure to turn on post notifications for the episode 3. So that, because that will be the episode where we pull Jameson. But yeah, that was the episode. Shoots.